All right, uh, YouTube, I thought that I would um, kind of explain to you what a Leslie is, for those that don't know what it is. Um, right here is my Motion Sound um, Pro 145. Um, no matter what brand it is, most Leslies work the same exact way. Some may just have a lower part, some may have just a horn, uh, but this is a all-in-one unit which means it's got the lower it's got the lower rotor and the um, horn in the top so this is how this works Don Leslie um, who was I believe manufactured his company and originally manufactured train horns he came up with an idea to give an organ an electric organ a bigger sound by create by emulating what's called the Doppler effect not emulating but creating the Doppler effect, which is sound being moved around. It's the same kind of um, thing you get when um, you listen to a train horn and it goes by and it seems to lose pitch as it goes by. Um, that's because of the Doppler effect. It's bouncing off different things and um, making it seem as if the pitch is changing. Well, that's what um, Don Leslie came with the idea for... Um, the rotating uh, speaker, as it were. Um, as you can see in the top, this rotating thing right here, it's a horn. On the bottom part of this horn, there's a driver, which uh, powers, the, powers the actual horn itself. Um, this is nothing more than just like a, oh, think of it as a, uh, as a directive device. The sound can only come out through that rotating through the rotating flange right there and as it moves around the sound gets thrown out but it can only come out of the one spot so the only time you hear it is when at whatever position that horn is at now that it's rotating slow you would hear the sound there and there and there um, and then down here there is the uh, woofer this is the uh, for the low for the low end um, and down here, sorry, my head's in the way here. Down here at the bottom, what you'll notice is a big drum that rotates. It's the same effect as you get from the top, but it's bigger because, of course, you've got a woofer. That is a 12 inch woofer that supplies the low end. And as it goes down, if you notice, there's a gap, not the hole, but if you notice, there's a gap right there, and there, and there. That gap is the only way that the uh, sound from the woofer can come out because it's being directed down through that drum. So what you get is a 360 degree um, thrown sound. It goes all the way, no matter where you are at in a room, pretty much you can hear a Leslie um, no matter what part of the room that you're in. Um, and I'll give you an example here. This technology is probably better than 70 years old, but this technology is still something that people are using. Like this is a this is a modern Leslie cabinet, um, and uh, but it still uses the same technology that the original Leslie cabinets from the 1930s and 40s used. I'm sorry, the 50s. So as you can hear, I'm going to get a sound here on my keyboard. What you'll notice here is as I play this, you will notice how how the sound changes. Right now, this thing is on what's called um, slow speed or choral speed. That's what they call it um, when it's on slow. It's called choral. So as I hit this button here, I got a foot switch here that controls what I'm doing. So as I hit the fast button, you see this light up. And as you see, the horn is starting to rotate. The horn always usually rotates faster, a faster rate than the, than the woofer does, just because it's a horn. It doesn't have as much 
mass to move as the uh, it doesn't have as much mass to move as the woofer on the bottom, the rotating drum on the bottom. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to slow it down for you so I can hear what it sounds like when it slows down. So also on this, there's a speed that you can stop. Now you'll notice here, it stops all together. The horn has stopped rotating and the lower drum has stopped rotating. Now it's back on slow speed. When it's on uh, high speed, it's known as tremolo because of the effect that it gives um, when you speed it up. But you can... Uh, these are very nice. Um, uh, over the years, Fender, has, Fender Guitar Company has made um, a type of Leslie. Um, just remember, the term Leslie is used because of Don Leslie, the guy that invented this rotating mechanical speaker system. Um, but just remember um, that that's another, it's like Kleenex. You know, not all, not all tissue is Kleenex. But everybody refers to tissue as Kleenex. Same kind of thing here. Um, this is called a rotary speaker system. So um, that's all I wanted to show you. And I hope this did some good. I hope you guys enjoy this video.